There's over three and a half billion daily searches on Google. This is teaching you how to take your piece of that. Almost around 50, approximately 50% 50 of three and a half billion daily searches are ending in an ad click. Google does a good job at disguising ads. It's extremely powerful. It exists nowhere else in the world. There's no other advertising platform that affords you that level of luxury, that level of specificity, that level of understanding commercial intent where you could really tie and predict to quite an accurate degree how likely a person is to be one of your customers. In this lecture, I want to talk about some astounding statistics about Google Ads, sort of what it is conceptually, and at the very least, make a compelling case um, if your boss or, your, or you're not ready or a client's not ready to really invest in Google Ads, some of these statistics will really help them uh, get on the Google Ads gravy train of profits. So first, 75% of search market share, Google dominates search. Yes, there's Bing advertising and Yahoo advertising. There's over three and a half billion daily searches on Google. People come to Google first and foremost. Now Amazon is, is picking up some market shares as the place where people come to begin searching for something to buy, but the king by far is still and will probably always be Google. People come to Google to search for what they're looking to buy, to find answers to their questions, to get relevant information about uh, purchasing decisions. In 2017, Google's revenues were 109 billion, that's a billion with a B as in baseball, 109 billion, 650 million, okay? That's a lot of money, that's a lot of revenue, 71% of that, so now, what is 71% of 109 billion, 650 million? Any, any uh, math whizzes out there? Uh, let's see, it's 71% um, is gonna be, 77 billion, 851 million, 500,000 dollars generated from Google Ads. Um, over 80, that amount of money spent on ads generated over $80 billion in economic activity per year from Google Ads. And this entire course is teaching you how to take your piece of that. That's the power of such a platform. Google Ads, when done right, when done profitably, could generate enormous amounts of money um, and it's generating enormous amounts of money for Google. I get this all the time from clients. Well, Isaac, you know, Google Ads is dead. No one clicks on those ads. I don't click on those ads. I scroll down past the first three ads and I find an organic result. Sure, plenty of people do that. Plenty of people search through and, and specifically won't click on an ad. That's the case. But the reality is, Right? The reality of the matter is 40 to 50% of all Google searches end in an ad click, result in a click on a sponsored result. Almost around 50, approximately 50% 50 of three and a half billion daily searches are ending in an ad click. So you hear the attitude that says, oh, no one clicks on the ads, I don't click on the ads, my mom doesn't click on the ads. Well, you can tell them th that's, that's nice, but around two billion people or two billion searches a day are ending in an ad click, okay? So that's, that's, that's 45.5 percent of people who were polled don't know the difference between a sponsored ad and, a, and an organic result. But the reason why Google ads on search specifically is so luxurious, why it's so different than any other display sort of advertising where it's more interruptive, this is per, not only is it permissive marketing, um, a user is searching for the answer to a specific question. I'm looking to buy men's running shoes. I'm looking for a local locksmith. Not only is it permissive, but you're able to show an ad when a person is specifically searching for what you offer. It's extremely powerful, it exists nowhere else in the world. There's no other advertising platform that affords you that level of luxury, that level of specificity, that level of understanding commercial intent where you could really tie and predict to quite an accurate degree how likely a person is to be one of your customers. Not only is Google Ads the most luxurious advertising network and advertising system in the world because you could capitalize on this thing called commercial intent. You could choose to show ads to people that are specifically looking for the products and services that you sell at the time that they're searching for the products and services you sell. Just let that sink in. That's incredible. That enough of is a reason to take this in extremely seriously. More importantly, you don't pay. You don't pay a penny to show an ad, okay? PPC advertising, pay-per-click advertising means you only pay Google, you only pay the advertising network when your ad is actually You could have an ad shown a million times. If you have an ad in position three or position two, it doesn't get clicked. A hundred thousand times that ad was shown on the page, you don't owe a penny to Google. You only get charged, you only owe money when a person actually clicks your ad and comes to your landing page. So imagine you're, you have a brick and mortar, mortar store on, on a street. Not only, imagine offering a certain amount of money to, for a person to walk into your store and browse, right? 
there's for sure a certain amount of money that's worth it to you because you're taking out ads, you're doing all these different things. So whether that's five cents, 10 cents, $2, there's, there's some amount of money where it's worth paying people to come into your store, but it gets so much better. Imagine you're able to just offer that 25 cents or a dollar to people who you know woke up this morning and said, I wanna buy the product you sell. You're, uh, you're a hardware store. And a person woke up this morning and said, I wanna buy a hammer. I wanna buy an electric drill. Right, and you somehow knew that, and you could offer just those people to come into your store and browse your shelves and, and look at the products you offer, and look, and you could even put them right in the specific aisle of the hammer or the electric drill that they want to buy. It's wild when you think about how accurate and how powerful and how useful, how relevant these ads could be. How you could seriously chose choose to spend that money in the most effective way possible to the, on the people that are interested in what you sell getting them into your online store, your web store. Whether this be for services or for content or for products, if it's e-commerce, is incredibly powerful and it doesn't exist anywhere else and it's not replicated even in any other form in any other advertising platform. So these statistics should make a very, very strong case for the power of Google Ads. In the very next lecture, I'm gonna show you a little, a little bit about what these ads look like in the real world, where ads actually show up, a little bit of uh, the anatomy of an ad, and after that, we're gonna jump into creating, finally, our very first Google Ads account together, step by step. I look forward to seeing you guys very soon in the very next lecture.